Hi guys, today is tutorials on bedazzling your nails. And this is what I have. Isn't it pretty? My thumb. <laughs> okay, so um, I'm actually just going to show the basics. Um, you guys can come up with any pattern you like. Um, this is one for example. Just, just crosswords diag diagonally. Or you can do them straight across. Whatever you guys want. But I'm just going to show you the basics of how to get them on and how to make them last. So. I'll explain. Um, the first thing I'm going to use is like a buffer. I'm using OPI Smoother. Um, and just, you know, buff your nail. Just like that. Oh, I'm trying to get it on here. Just buff your nail like this. You know, not so much. But just a little, so it's a little scratch. Let me buff it really quick. Just buff it. Get it a little scratch. See? Wipe it down. You know, whatever you want to do. Now, you're going to choose whatever rhinestones you want. Um... A lot of people are going to ask where I got this. I actually got this at like a little swap man. As you can see, look, I'm kind of almost out of some of them. But this one's kind of hard to open when I push it. Like it, it bounces around. So I kind of lost a couple of those. And this one is just, um, oh, I hate when my camera focuses. It's just silver. <clears throat> so, um, yeah. You know, fire your nail, like I said. Now, um... Just open up whatever color you want. I'm just going to use these. I'm going to use the silver ones and I'm going to use the bigger sized ones. So you guys can see. Um, the, and also you're going to need nail glue. Um, super glue works but I just kind of recommend working on nail glue. And um, you can tap a little drop on anything, any surface. I'm just going to drop it like on here. So I'm just going to drop a little drop right there on my um, little plate thingy. Close that up. Make sure you guys close that because if not, um, it'll be horrible. So just take your little tweezers, like so, and just pull out one um, little bead. See? I have a bead. Now get the little bead within your little tweezers. See? Just like this. Now you guys are... Oh! Trying to get it to focus. Yeah. Well, you guys don't know what side is the shiny side. So all you're going to do is dip it into your little glue just like that and then take your little um, thing and just place it on your nail and now it's gonna be a little wet so don't try to force it as much just let it slide kinda now let it dry it for a little bit then you wanna push it just a tad bit like I want it to be on my nail like on the um, on the what is it called the little free edge of my nail just let it sit there then I'm gonna take another one and sometimes they might be glued spreading spreading out so I'm gonna take that same one um, lay it on there and move it towards where that one was right next to it and there you go see I'm gonna just place it on there and if I want to move it just move it around see how that's there super super simple um, now I'm going to let that dry for a little bit and then I'll be back to show you guys what I do next to make them last. Okay, now that my nail is dried, oh, I swear to guys, you guys, I'm sorry that it doesn't focus as well. But now that my nail is dry, um, you can either leave it like that, but I've noticed that if I leave it like this without nothing on top, it's going to just kind of fall. Like, they all tend to fall. Like, these, I did it earlier today, and they fell. But, um, because I did not add a top coat of, a, of a nail polish. Now, nail polish, you know, like a clear one, it's just going to be, um, you know, clear. So, um, what I do is, um, I let my nail dry, then I take a top coat. I'm using Start to Finish by OPI. This is came in my OPI kit. I don't know if this clear one is sold, but I mean, all they have a top coat. So just open up that nail polish. And I actually like OPI, you guys. I want to go get um, the Alice in Wonderland, but they didn't have it anymore. The um, Mad as a Hatter. Just take your nail and just um, let, make sure it's dry, though. Then apply a, a simple top coat just like that. Now that you've done that, it's going to just set, let it dry. And that's it. That's all you need to do. Now, like I said, this video is the basics of just how to get it on there. 
Now I will be doing a video on how to get um these love this is lovely nail right here, but I'll probably do that tomorrow when I have nothing to do at school. So I'll be doing this tomorrow and um I'll be uploading how to you know come up with little different designs and things like that. Now this is really pretty so I hope you guys um enjoyed this lovely little tutorial of mine. <laughs>